everyone welcome back to the channel it is faces by Brittany here and today i'm going to be sharing with you all the fragrances i wore this week <music> with what i wore monday so i knew i wanted to wear joe malone ginger biscuit it's been a good minute since i wore this plus monday was freezing so i was like okay i guess we're going to be pulling back out my winter fragrances girl like this fragrance it has a top note of ginger and you can get the ginger straight off rip. If you don't like ginger, it takes a little while for the spiciness to calm down. But I'm not mad at ginger. Like, I don't have a problem with ginger. This smells so good. It's not overly sweet. It's not super spicy to me. I know this um comes out like every so often with this brand. So... If you are interested in it, you will probably be able to find maybe samples or someone maybe re um, selling it, but you're not going to be able to find this right now. But, oh my goodness, this, I I love this instantly. So, um, what I wanted to wear underneath it was my Georgia's Girl Gingerbread Cookie Body Butter. I've mentioned this uh, brand on my channel before. Girl, her products are amazing, especially her body butters, her body scrubs. Speechless. You won't find another. Not this price either. <sighs> this is giving gingerbread cookie. It doesn't have the spice like the Jo Malone fragrance. It's more of the sweetness with a hint, a very slight hint of the spiciness, but the sweetness is overtaking it. It smells so perfect underneath this fragrance. So I wanted to bring in my cookie butter body oil from Scam Potion. Y'all know when I first got this, I was just like, what the heck? It's not like maple syrup, but I feel like I'm getting the other notes in this fragrance as well. So I wanted to use this. I got, I'm getting a little dent in it now. I'm kind of proud of that because at first I thought it was going to take me a real long time to start liking this. But this smells so freaking good. And I love that this body oil soaks in. It doesn't leave you super oily. It like gets into the skin and does what it needs to do. There's some oils that I have that just sit on top of the skin and it takes a long time especially if you over apply it but i like that this has a pump to it so you control how much you're using and this bad boy is a beast so i wouldn't like overuse this if you want to actually smell the fragrance that you have on that day okay like she be trying to take over fragrances like relax you're an oil <laughs> I need you to relax so I did use that oil just to seal in the moisture because it was cold that day and after I sprayed down with ginger biscuit I like using ginger biscuit on my clothes and my skin because I find that it lasts longer Jo Malone fragrances um, from what I heard really doesn't have the longevity so I know with this one which I've experienced that it lasts longer when I spray it on my clothes as well and that's why i don't mind spraying it sometimes in my hair too just so that if i'm swinging these locks child they be like oh yeah it is i so <laughs> to top everything else i did use bear vanilla my victoria's secret i've expressed my love for this spray since i got her we're not going to stay on her, but I love this spray. I love this vanilla. It's so, it's like a warm embrace. It's a warm embrace. So I wanted that warm embrace with this very comforting combination. And it was beautiful. It was perfect for the weather. Very cold. 
and I wanted something that just felt like a warm embrace because maybe it's it was chilly in Ohio. Okay. Tuesday, this is the combination that I wore. Tuesday, it was starting to feel like spring. Don't ask me if you're from Ohio. This is our norm. Unfortunately, this is our norm. So I haven't used my Jimmy Choo uh, fragrance in a while. This one is, I know it's low. I'm going to get the exact name of it on here. But this one, it smells so good. It's fresh. It's floral. It's clean. It smells like spring in a bottle. When I first sprayed this, I was, once I went through my sample, I knew I was going to get a full size bottle. And it's like, it's giving a mature not mature but mature like a grown sexy springtime fragrance this one is so beautiful like, i really really love this fragrance so i knew i was gonna pull her out um once it start getting springtime i know i'm getting a lot of use out of this and i can't wait to love on it some more i'm gonna put the notes on the screen but i really love love this um fragrance I don't see many people talking about it, and they should. Like, if you love floral, clean, springy scents, this is really good. So, under that, um, I use my Ms. Dior. Now, this is their body milk. This smells so good to me. This smells so good. I kind of want to put it on right now. It's so good. It doesn't smell overly floral. It just smells like a clean pink. It smells like a clean pink scent. Like, I don't want to say it smells like baby lotion. It doesn't smell like baby lotion. But like a really pretty pink lotion. Like, it, whatever pink make you imagine, that's what this puts me in a mind state of it wasn't very heavy it's a um lotion that what well, it really is a lotion it's not a body cream y'all know i love i love body creams it's a lotion and it's really good it's hydrating so i use that all over follow up with my jimmy Choo, and girl this is a fragrance that i purchased from tiktok i um shared this with y'all in my tiktok finds video i had to wear it that day. I was not playing. This one is a dupe for My Way Intense. It is a an exact dupe for My Way Intense. I'm not kidding. Oh. It's like, it's giving a little fruitier. Oh, but it is gorgeous. And this is like $12.00. So good. And the packaging is looks like girl, TikTok. Oh, so I topped this um on top of Jimmy Choo. This is beautiful. Like this is beautiful. This is beautiful. So I want to keep in that pink family. Every time I wear anything pink, I just want to use all pink stuff. So I wanted to use um the number 68 So de Janeiro fragrance this is like the um what i want to say it is the body mist do for tribeca you do get like a baccarat um essence to it but i love this spray i, I love this spray this is so pretty is like sophisticated it puts you in the mind of baccarat as well as tribeca so I wanted these to stand out, but um, since this one gives me like a sophisticated feel to it, I wanted to make sure that my body spray gave that sophistication and I, it was perfect. I smelled so good. Like I knew I smelled good. Oh, it was, it was a beautiful day. So yes, I'm running this back. I don't care. I'm running it back. Now, let's get into Wednesday. Y'all know 
If you've been following me, y'all know this combination had me in the biggest chokehold ever. I don't know what it is about Born Aroma with Billie Eilish. Don't know what it is. I don't know what made me put them together. I seriously do not know. But when I put them together, both their hands just wrapped around my entire body. And I've been locked in ever since. So this, if you have not tried these common, these two combined, like they're soulmates. I just, I can't, <laughs> like, ooh, I don't know what it is about them. Mm. Let me, let me just stop, okay? <sighs> they just do something to me. Like, we're in a poly relationship. And I'm not afraid to let the world know like y'all have to experience these two together so i wanted to use victory secret bear vanilla underneath mm. Lord. <laughs> this <laughs> i'm so sorry this <sighs> this lotion with that spray like i cannot get enough it's it's so beautiful this vanilla is just so so beautiful <sighs> so i just want to you know give them a beautiful chow you know when they come together it makes this like it's just you know like it's just right i have to do this justice and i told y'all when i wear born roma i have to put something vanilla underneath it it just hits I don't know it's just head like so i use bare vanilla you can spray either one of these first it really doesn't matter but baby listen then y'all know how i feel about this vanilla and dreamy by victoria's secret this The atomizer on here is crazy. You get so much fragrance out this spray. Like, the atomizer soaks you up. Like, tsunami. Like, girl, I don't know. Because not all the atomizers are like that. Maybe it's just mine, but it is not consistent with Victoria's Secret. But I really don't care because this one is gorgeous. And this honestly smells like Billie Eilish to me. It's not like Billie Eilish to me, like just a very light version of it. So I, that is why I added this to this trio or because it gives me a lighter version of Billie. So honestly, y'all, what you could do is that first, then Billie, Born Aroma, and then this to really get like a good mesh of everything. Like, oh. <sighs> that one just try it just try it and report back here immediately because i know you're gonna love it thursday we had another cold day another cold day so i knew i had to wear my vanillas again but i wanted something a little like just all vanilla base but a little deeper and more on a woozy instead of spicy side so I pull out my Philosophy Fresh Cream Warm Cashmere Spray. This is another beauty. Like, this is beautiful. This is like... It, it gives you a warm sweater, like cashmere sweater. You're hugging someone else with a cashmere sweater. And y'all both just squeezing each other tight because you haven't seen each other in a while. This is what this fragrance give me. I wish it was a perfume. It's a toilet. 
but oh my goodness it is beautiful like this is beautiful it's like 52 dollars beautiful so what i used underneath was wrapped in vanilla by bath and body works why didn't they run this back why didn't they run this back i'm just so upset i'm i have one backup of this and they did not run this back i don't know what i'm gonna do when i'm done with my other backup like this is getting down like i can this is getting down like it's, it's getting real scary it's looking real oppy outside what is going on but this has notes of soft vanilla velvet sugar chantilly cream this is a beautiful beautiful vanilla <sighs> mm, it almost smells like a sugar cookie a vanilla sugar cookie It's just something about Bath and Body Works vanillas. They can do a vanilla. Okay. They can do a vanilla. I have not found anything to replace this. Like, there is nothing that smells like this. No, I really don't know what I'm going to do. Because warm vanilla sugar don't smell like this. I actually don't even like that uh, lotion at all. I don't. I don't like that one. That one is too basic for me. Oh, this. I'm, I gotta search to see. <laughs> I, gotta, I gotta figure something out. But I wore this, and because this is a toilet and I want it to last longer, I did use my Vanilla Musk Fragrance Oil by Nima all over. Um, because I have like three of these, so I just kind of pour it in my hand, rub it together, and like press it into my skin. Um, especially the places that I know I'm going to have a warm cashmere on. So basically, my neck to my decollete um, and my my wrist. So not all over my body, cause we ain't doing all that. This is like a hold on girl <laughs> you go get your shot this is like a little 20 dollar fragrance oil so i'm not gonna be like i'm not doing all that but this is really really pretty so i use that underneath warm cashmere spray down and then vanilla skin by fleur i see why the girly sold this out three times you hear me? First of all, the itemizer on here is, is great. I've never experienced like mm, this smells so freaking good. And it's like it gives me woody, vanilla. Oh, it's oh my god. So Top notes is pink pepper, pink apple, sugar crystals. The heart notes are lily, jasmine petals, cashmere wood. The base is benzoin, vanilla, sandalwood, and argan wood. Oh, I never knew I loved a woody vanilla until I smelled this at Sephora. And I knew I needed the largest bottle. This vanilla is so intoxicating. It's sexy. It's woody. It is everything. It is everything. Like, it, oh, and the wind was blowing that day because, you know, it can't just be cold, regular cold. It got to be cold and windy. Like, is it Chicago? Or do I live okay but if you have this you know mm, this is sexy i love this miss 
so bad. So let's just say I was in love. I was in love, in love, in love, in love. See, Ash, I was you. Oof, I smell amazing. I couldn't actually wait for the wind to blow so I can bless everyone else. I wanted somebody to catch a whiff of my wind because I can't be the only one enjoying this. This was a good day. So, child, let me tell you about this. So, I'm y'all probably tired of seeing this fragrance. <laughs> I have been getting my life with this. I truly have. I told y'all that just it just keeps smelling better and better. It just smell better and better to me. Oh, it is a sexy fragrance. La Capital, if you have never seen this before, is by Zerzhov. It is a beautiful, sexy, strawberry, vanilla, peach, leathery scent. Girl. I've been getting my life. I've been getting my life. So I know that usually I pair a fruity lotion with this fragrance, but I wanted to play with a bourbon vanilla note that's in that fragrance. Girl, so cozy vanilla bourbon by Bath and Body Works has notes of warm bourbon, dark fruit, vanilla liqueur. This y'all, y'all knew I had a backup of this. I have two of these. And this one, I'm not playing with Bath and Body Works at all. I don't play with them people. If <laughs> I love something from them, I buy backups. You just don't know with them. You may never see it again in your life. So this is one of those ones I might never see again. So I had to. Because they're not going to play me the way they play me with warm, wrapped in vanilla. I, I can't afford that. I can't. So, vanilla bourbon. Oh, this is a sexy, grown and sexy vanilla. Okay. So, I didn't know how much it would change that. It was beautiful underneath that fragrance. Beautiful. It warmed it up. Scale back some of the peachy, fruity notes in here. Then I had to top it off with bourbon, strawberry. I mean, bourbon, strawberry, and vanilla. The notes are bourbon, vanilla, garden, strawberry, apricot, nectar, pink, jasmine, and white oak. This is so nice. It is so nice. Like, it's not super fruity. Like the um, strawberry uh, shortcake from them. It is a grown strawberry. And the strawberry in here is a little artificial to me. I wish it was more realistic. Like the garden of strawberry they said they picked. It's a little artificial. But it was perfect with that. I... All the bourbon and vanilla I had on that day, I'm surprised I was able to make it, to make this video. Like, I'm still here. And I thank God for another day because I could be in someone's basement. I smelled that good. I smelled good. Like, try this combo. If you have this, you you gonna you gonna want to try it with that. Saturday, I decided to tap into my Gucci Guilty. I remember when I first got this, I loved this. I just knew it was gonna be my signature scent for life. I remember I used to always smell this on one of the managers I worked with when I worked at Macy's, and she always smelled so good. But I never wanted to ask her. Um, what she had on but somebody else knew what she had on and i was like oh i'll never be able to afford that i was like 20 21 girl i was not i was in college 
or just graduated college. I was like, yeah, that's it for me. <laughs> Gucci? No, I couldn't even afford Poochie. Mm -mm. So the fact that I like have it is like, <sighs> wow, I was able to get it. <laughs> it took some time, but I was able to get it. So this one, it's so grown and sexy. I didn't know this had peach in it. And now that I keep smelling it, I'm like, I do smell the peach. Like, I think the peach is at the top of this. So I wanted to use my peach milk. Y'all know this is my little TJ Maxx fine. Girl, this smells so good. Like, it's giving peach smoothie. I told y'all this before, and I've been wearing her since. I'm not playing. This made the video, what, like two times now? I don't play around. I've been using this bad boy since I got her. Like, I, I'm pretty sure you can still find her. But, girl, this smells so freaking good. So, after I used that, I wanted something more hydrating. And I wanted to bring out that peach scent more and Gucci Guilty. So I use Brown Sugar Bay, just peachy. I have the full size of this. Um, they sent me this complimentary when I ordered something. And the order came pretty late. So they just popped that in there. But I'm like, oh, this is cute because I can actually travel with this. But this smells so freaking good. It is the juiciest peach ever. This freaking body oil peach dripping down your body this smells so freaking good i cannot y'all if you want me to make a video of my favorite brown sugar baby body oils this would definitely be in there but i would make that video if y'all would like but this just know Top three, not number three. It's not number three. This, let me stop. So I sprayed down with my Gucci Guilty. Um, this one, I know they have the perfume. It's in a different bottle. This is just a toilet. So I did spray a little heavy with this because it is a toilet. And... Pretty as a peach. Pretty as a peach. She made the video again. Blush and peach, jasmine petals, white nectarine, apple blossom, sheer freesia. This. I don't even have to put my nose to it. I can smell it now. It smells beautiful. Like, I, I love it. I, I love it. I don't have the lotion or the body cream simply because I have this and it's just so big. Like, it would take me so long, y'all. So that's the only reason I don't have the lotion to this bad boy. But this is gorgeous. I love Pretty as a Peach. It is so pretty. It's not heavy. It's light. It's airy. It's a gorgeous peach scent. It's gorgeous. So... I, it was only right. It was only right. Like, mm, Sunday, it felt amazing. It felt amazing. And then I went to Indy after I got done with my clients. So I wanted something that was screaming springtime, something that's not doing too much. I don't want too much attention. I just want to smell good. I want to smell pretty. So I used the Cosmic by Kylie Jenner fragrance. I did a review on this. What what can I say? It, it, if it looks like it's a bigger bottle, it is. <laughs> I did trade in that 1.7 for the three. I did. I was trying to resist it, but the resisting didn't work. It failed. I knew I was going to do that. But I didn't want to do it. I was going back and forth for myself, but somehow I ended up also with the bottle in my hand to return, and they just gave me a bigger one. I just don't know. 
<sighs> this is pretty like you don't have to think about this you don't have to think about this like this fragrance is truly just like an easy reach like it's an easy reach it smells good it's not too loud of a fragrance it's just it's really pretty so i use a thousand wishes i will um post the notes again but i use a thousand wishes underneath it the notes in here is pink prosecco sparkling quincy crystal peonies gilded amber and amaretto cream it's been a minute since i wore a thousand wishes oh my god i had to scrub and i finally ran out and i'm just so upset i'm so upset i need that um body scrub back in my life for sure like this one i love a thousand wishes like this is one of my tops with them like with bath and body works this is one of my top fragrances top scents with them this is i have a backup of this we're not playing games i just in case they want to change their mind and that's continuing it i'm not playing with them um, <laughs> I'm just not playing with them. So I use that underneath. Oh, it's so gorgeous. And then I use this, which is um gorgeous. It's gingham gorgeous. So the notes in here are pink strawberries, peak or peach nectar, and peony blooms. This is so pretty. Like it's like uh a pretty girl scent. it really is like when you think of the color pink if you i want to smell pink and i'm using like pink lotions and a pink kind of fragrance i love reaching for this one it is so pretty it's light it's elegant that is so pretty like i smell amazing i smell amazing and the wind was blowing that day it just smelled I just smell so good. And I think what all this had in common was peony. Because that's a note. Y'all know I like playing with the notes. And these. My white coat. My white lab coat is on the way. I told y'all last video. I was going to have it. It's on the way. It's on the way. So yeah. Yeah. So I hope you enjoyed today's video. Give it a big thumbs up if you did. Comment below. Let me know what you wore last week or what you plan on wearing this week. Child, I know my week was kind of all over the place, but girl, this weather, it's been doing whatever it, it wants. So let's just say I'm ready for spring. It's to be real spring. <laughs> so I will see you all in my next video. Bye.